The presidential election has turned into a three-way. People First Party Chairman Jim Sung officially announced his candidacy at a press conference on Wednesday. He also revealed that his running mate will be advertising mogul Sandra Yu. This will be Sung's fourth attempt at the presidency after three defeats in the last two decades. The 77-year-old perennial candidate said this would be the last campaign of his political career. Surrounded by supporters, Chairman Song announced his 2020 presidential bid. Next year's presidential elections on January 11th will be my sixth battle. It's like that movie, Endgame. I hope to channel the fictional character Dugu Chobai. I have been preparing for this battle for 44 years. The 77-year-old politician said 2020 would be his final battle. He said he was trying again one last time because of Terry Go. It was only on September 17th of this year that I began considering another presidential run. It was because the previous night, Terry Go announced his withdrawal from the race. If the Taiwanese people can't free themselves from the blue and green fetters of emotional blackmail and scare tactics, that would be extremely lamentable. Both Go and Taipei Mayor Ko and Jess sent representatives to the event. Ko's envoy was Taipei Deputy Mayor Tai Bing Kun. He and Go both sent signed flower arrangements. I want to make it clear that our party list will be influenced by Terry Go. Song said the party list would have room for members of Go's camp. Sources say one of them could be Amanda Liu, the CEO of Go's Yongling Healthcare Foundation, and its deputy chief executive, Tai Qingyu. We are still discussing the list. We hope that a force that's neither green nor blue will be able to break through and enter legislature. Song is rising from the ashes. It's the final stand of an old war horse who holds the record for the most attempts at Taiwan's presidency.